All right. Here we are. Doing a quick stream today. It's got an early call time. And we already played this for a couple hours on another day. That was an offline stream. It was fun. Just kind of cool to play an old, an older turn-based RPG game. Go. So just mention this up on my YouTube. Let's see here. These graphics are amazing. Here lie the bodies of many dwarven generations. Many were slaughtered by invading orcs that bred and multiplied in warriors' darkness. Now they rule the vast halls and spread through the corridors at mines. But they do not rule Boria. That is the province of another, more powerful being. Tread carefully in the darkness, for you enter a world of enemies. Move swiftly, for if you do not, I shall find you. This isn't working at all. Can move this. Can't zoom in. Whatever. Look at that water. I don't know if I've actually gotten this far in the game. I feel like I must have gotten further than this in the game. Love Sauron attacks. This guy again? Not 
to recruit from here to defense. Company Valley. Cracked elf zone of armor enhancements. And then some other stuff. Very good. You have now entered the long dark of Moria. Moria is a lost civilization that spans many ages. And in the deep Places of this world, foul terrors still dwell, filled with wrath and malice. I expect you found the landscape changed since we recently passed through. That was the work of the Watcher in the water. For what good are words of opening, or enchanted doors for that matter, against such ancient powers?
where is the fancy door that they came and went into? I wonder if, if they were attacked here, maybe this is the door? No, it's too smooth. Man, I am so tired. Elf enhancement. These things are strong, right? Yay, yeah, missed. Oh no. to try and play as the other one. Great items for use when combat because it's King's Fall with Iron Cross Man. Yep. Yeah, so many of these videos. Saruman admires the war, the terrible creation that mocks the wolf. The war. To spread terror, he unleashed them upon the lands surrounding Isengard. They are fast and powerful creatures able to bring down a horse and rider. Few can withstand their attack. There is evidence they invaded Moria, but I avoided their dens. I hope we were as fortunate. I think I want to change my party. How do you change the party? Do it here. 
Parathor. What? It's confusing. change your character but well, I don't understand how you can change your party if I can figure this out if I go out here. What you change party makes more the inner D. figure out how to change my players here. Huh. Very confusing. Not intuitive at all. Well, let's see. We'll get into a battle. Let's see. Come on, Hadhood, go faster. Ah! He's not even show. Steel Lambertses.
Oh well, yeah, I have no idea how you change party members in this game. The reason to stay in this game is just for the free rebreast. Oh, I feel sleepy today. to kill. I might resent that remark, but I think you're right. What have you got there? It would appear we have discovered the last delving of the dwarves. The great mithril pit. Great mithril pit. And that mine would likely lead us to the other side of the mountain, would it not? So what do we wait for? Let us follow it! Another one. So many of these. I see you found your way deep into Moria's mithril mines. For that was the true wealth of this realm. Hard as dragon scales, but light as a feather. It has no rival in times of war. Some seek it unto death. Some are given it freely. The lands you passed through were built around its trade. Now none dare seek it in these dark halls.
I must say I am very dark on camera for this. Because it's a very dark looking game. I should probably invest in the light. I do actually have a light, but I'm gonna get like a stand and I don't like having like an extra stand there. I'm gonna find a nice sword. Shirk. I can tell you like, when the boss are actually up.
my scenes. Do not fear as you wander Moria's mazes, for powerful beings such as I are here to aid you. Oh. For many long years I have played the role of a grey wanderer across the lands of Middle-earth. Another, the white wizard Saruman, calls himself the leader of our order. But Saruman chose to see afar, to see all, and in his greed he became enslaved. We have had, you see, a falling out. And thus his servants have forced our party to skirt Saruman's domain. For he hopes that within Moria, I shall fall to a greater power than even he possesses. Oh. to go down. Must be more. Hey guys, sleepy. These little flashing lights on the map made. They know it not, but these wretched orcs are trapped within these halls. They hide from the sun, but more do they fear their new master. The Balrog. They awaken him in times of great need yet always fall victim to his terrible wrath. Wrath. The blinking went away over there. Maybe there's something on this lower level here. I already got this one. Maybe there's something on a lower level here. Naruhodo! Ah!
Hmm. Room three of seven. Get a free heal here. Ooh, this map looks a little confusing now. Another scene. You have found our campsite. That is very good indeed. You have also found Boromir, for he has traveled with us since Rivendell. Have you considered Berathor precisely why you were compelled to seek him? Many that live deserve death, and some that die deserve life. Do not be too eager to deal out death and judgment. Even the very wise can see all ends. Looks like I already missed one too. I missed an orb. Hmm. It's a whole maze. Oh, this is cool. This is like how you find all the tombs and stuff.
this. You did. This is the way forward. How can we open this? We will have to unlock Moria's secrets first. Yes, before the goblins trap us here. Something happens when you get all seven rooms. Ah.
I am trying to crash right now. It's only 50 minutes into my stream. I call it at 8 o'clock. Short stream today. Oh, and everyone's too busy to come to my lonely channel. Watch me play this old game. Glazing over. Reed knows only fear and domination. It does not matter their size. Remember this lesson well, for there are much more powerful orcs upon your road. And some I hope you never encounter. Yeah.
I'm barely staying awake. Where is the save point? Oh, I want to sleep here. I want to go sleep. Oh, there's water. Got a short stream tonight. I'm actually just trying to get to a save spot. I'm falling asleep over here. How are you? Long have I walked the forgotten paths of Middle Earth, and oft I studied the treasury of that past. Thousands of years ago, I am ready for this week to be over. With men, and for the weekend to overthrowing start, overthrowing the evil of Sauron. I have a. Uh, Early call time tomorrow. I have to be on site at 6 a.m. in San Francisco. Extends I gotta wake up at 4:30 so I can drive None there. speak of deeds that divided them, but ancient distrust still burns in the heart of both races. Have you heard nothing, Lord Elrond has said? The ring must be destroyed. And I suppose you think you're the one to do it. So much of No, I trust them all. No, I trust them all. You witness a rare thing, Gondorian. Elf and dwarf united in uneasy fellowship. But as you travel these lands, your small company faces the same. Hey, Crab, are you, are you a Lord of the Rings Unite fan them, at all? For the remaining treasures of Moria I'm a will fan not of be movies, surrendered without and I like a the fight. Amazon show. Music is great, but so I've never read a book of theirs. From Never read a Lord of the Rings book. Never read any of them. This one's better. Ooh, new weapon. There you go. You're more of a Star Wars gal, but you've been watching a lot of Lord of the Rings parody videos. 
Have you watched any Lord of the Rings at all? Yeah, you get more spirit up for this elf. This one here, spirit speed. This one, raise that. This one here, and then let's raise the speed and constitution. Ooh, another one. Man, so many stuff. Armor enhancement. I think. Give it to this guy. He's, it'll become a tank. I have been on three battles on this little bridge. Come on, sleep. Oh, that's good. Ah. I think we gotta use the perfect mode. Arrow volley. Yeah. You barely remember, but you watch Return of the King. Dude, I kind of want to make you watch Lord of the Rings with us. <laughs> I wouldn't say I'm a big Lord of the Rings fan, but I'm a bigger fan than most. I haven't gotten to the point where I've read the books. Ah, oh, there's some runes in here. I know Tyler was a very big fan of the game, of, of, of the books and the movies, and he watched a lot. The Hobbit's not very good. I don't recommend The Hobbit. The movies, the book's okay. That's the only one I actually read, with The Hobbit, because it's pretty short. I kind of want to reread it, because it is a short book. Barathor is here, which is good. So I'm playing some retro games right now. This is actual PlayStation 2 footage. It's not an emulator. Put the Valor up. Ooh, pull my shield. And I'm playing this both online and offline. These graphics, they, you know, I'm able to make up the character models. So I've got that going <laughs> for Dwarven, please. I like how the music is actually in this game. You can hear it in the soundtrack. I have a bunch of other PlayStation 2 games I was going to stream this year. Oh, and guess what I did yesterday? I pre-ordered a certain game that comes out in... Um, math, must do math. It comes out in, I don't know, 40, 40 days? About 40 days from now? Comes out on February 29th. Pretty exciting. Had hood. This game that comes out in about 40 days or so, it's a remake of a game that came out in 1997. Take that, little goblin. That's right, I pre-ordered Final Fantasy. Hey, 
and I, I splurge Ariana let me do it. I pre-ordered a physical version of it and it comes with, it's the deluxe version of it, so it comes with a little soundtrack and it comes with an art book, steel case. You are graced, my friend, for the Lady of the Light guards and guides you. The elves channel the powers of fire, air, earth, and water, for they are the firstborn. Should you survive? The game was expensive. It was seventy dollars. So for thirty dollars more well. to get like a little bit of other things. Despite cool. the evil you carry with you. For many long ages has the Lady Galadriel This this part in the first movie scared me so much. Go now and finish your task. They await you beneath the trees. Also, when um, Bilbo turned evil, that scared me too. Probably just see the stats now. Spirit, strength, constitution. Spirit, strength, constitution, strength, spirit, speed. You're easily scared of spiders and the orcs and the golem scared me as a kid. So, have you played the new Hogwarts Legacy game? Because that has spiders in it. Found a rune. You played the whole thing. Did you turn on the... Uh, did you know that there was an arachnophobia mode? Did you turn on the arachnophobia <laughs> mode? <laughs> Who dares? I think I do! The arachnophobia mode in the game is really funny because it... It just... Look it up on YouTube. It's, it's very bizarre. Give this to... Yeah. We did for a little bit just to look at it, but well, I'm not that scared of spiders, fortunately. This looks like. Whoa! Oh, it's immune? I waste my turn. Well, I either kill it with you know, a napkin or I suck it up with a vacuum cleaner. <laughs> Let's get rid of this guy. What? Oh, no. Does not go well. Are you going to get Final Fantasy Rebirth on day one? Damn. Did you play Final Fantasy VII Remake at all when it came to PC? Dude, we need to get rid of that guy. I live that tree. No, Idrio!
Oh no, Barracko's at night. Oh no. What do I think of the story direction? I loved it. I really liked how it was like a like a strong anime. Which one is the uh, revive? Your little Earth Nomura is doing this multiverse nonsense. Uh, well, I mean, did you, like, I wouldn't really be happy if it was a shot for shot, story by story remake of 7, because there's just, why would I play the game, aside from the, the stellar combat, combat game. And I would want the story to be just a little different, just because it's, you know, like, I'd like to see what else there is. Definitely need to go to this one here. I guess it's like... If, like, if when you played Final Fantasy VII, so many players back in the day would try and see if they could, you know, somehow save Aerith at the end of it. And it's like, well, you know, I kind of wonder, like, would we be able to somehow do it? I mean, I thought Jesse was cool. She actually got a good storyline. Yeah. And I, I just, I thought the combat and the music was so good. And as I played the game, I just felt so cool playing the game. Like I felt like I was a hero. Like, very cool. Yeah, there's that, but I just sometimes feel like it kind of downplays your panic stuff. How- explain more about that, the traumatic stuff. Because the way I feel about it is that it- it- there's a lot of emotional connections in the game, and knowing that there are things looming in the future, you know, like, is there more to it? Well, like, Zack dying and Aerith dying, they're, they're part of, like, that original story, but, like, if you can somehow rebirth the world, that, that's an interesting thing to me. This person needs to die. Okay, now, now we can do this. We'll do... I, um... Yeah, I I do. Oh no, I did the wrong thing. <laughs> yeah. Should probably do it to her. You're a big shipper of them. Well, they're the original. Did you play? Um, you you must have been played Crisis Core then, right? Oh, you, you watched that. I played it originally on the PSP, and I really loved it. I thought it was great. The only thing I didn't like about it was that it's, it's incredibly linear. Like, even by today's standards of linear gameplay, it is way too linear, but that's just the physical... Um, Restrictions of the PSP at the time. Um, but Crisis Core, it's on PS4, and if you have a Switch, it's on Switch. It's worth playing because the story and the gameplay it is good. I did enjoy it a lot. that. Let's hope that Hadhood actually lands up here. 
Oh, well, Crisis Core is not a turn-based game. Crisis Core is an action RPG game. So, the way that I like to look at it is that Crisis Core is kind of the game before Final Fantasy VII Remake. So, if you liked, you know... It's just, it's not a regular RPG, which is, like, why it's so much fun, because it, it's so fast-paced. This is good. Yeah. Ew, my outfit's ugly. Can fuse it. Remember, it had that casino little mini game. I don't. Know. What was the casino mini game? I don't remember that. This one definitely needs to have more defense. I actually kind of like having that more. So maybe they're not as strong, but they're very, like, tanky. It's a thing you did during... Yeah, yep. It was a weird little roll thing. Methinks I should have saved there. I didn't save there. What do we have here? Ooh, a cool axe. Can't you tell by the wrapping of the shaft? It's the last axe ever forged in Moria. A respected ranger. I'm sorry, my friend. I meant no disrespect. New axe. Third age axe. As you have learned, my friend, dwarves are formidable tunnel fighters. Now, as you behold their shattered armories, you glimpse weapons wielded long in the defense of Moria. Tools and devices of war, large and small, were forged here. Some have been lost, some recently found, but the greatest of all still remains hidden. Ooh, what will we find? Gotta open up the this rune thing here. No! Another battle. These battles are a little slow paced, don't you think? I keep bringing that as green arrow as like a comic book character. Look at this battle at victory animation. <laughs> There's one more rune. What I would like to know is my skills for Bear Thor. Because he had a counterattack that I'm learning. Oh, he's still learning the counterattack. Trying to get that. That would give me some extra puntos. Some extra pintos. 
So for this game, uh, Crab, I'm doing an offline online playthrough, and it's uh, what I also it's the same stuff that I did during God of War Ragnarok. I didn't stream the whole thing because uh, I'm actually trying to beat this game in time for other games. But I, ooh, what's is that a book? Why can't I read the book? Oh, well. Pauldrons. Another scene to watch. So much scenes. Orcs are a cruel race. Their nature shaped by the hatred of the Dark Lord. Destruction and pain are all they know. And in Moria, they have become a small, cruel breed the elves call goblins. I shall tell you more should we survive our current encounter with these creatures. I think that they actually had Sir Ian McKellen record these lines just for the game. Oh, I forgot to equip the pauldrons. Oh, 876 HP in the hit. What? He has a counterattack? Dude, that's lame. I don't have a counterattack. Yeah, at least he missed. See that guy? The orc is like, ooh. Stupid orc. Uh, I should have Galadriel fight that one. While I tend to this beastie. Burning strike on this one. It's dead. And then, just because I want to continue to increase the SP points, just the goblin, that... And I actually want to, with this, go to Helagost, so I can use creature range. Ranged attack at two foes, that's, that's useful. Creature bang. Yeah. He's dead. What? No way. Now it's dead. Yes. That beastie be dead. You know, playing games like this on the PlayStation 2, they make me realize how fast-paced games were, are today. Because, like, this is, uh, you know, walking, random encounters. Yeah, this makes me sleepy. You gotta wait for the loading time to go to the fight. Oh my god, there's so many of them. Yeah. 
Hehe. Steve. We need some bear fur over here. Bear fur, kick his butt. Crit. Oh. Eat this. Triple critical. Yeah. Twenty twenty one each. Also change your character that you walk on, but I haven't figured out how to change your party outside of them. Okay, so now the last one we go is here. It's the last passage. The last passage, the final, ultimo passage. Uh oh, There's lava, fire down there. I don't know why it's red. Uh oh, scurry. Yes, save point. All right, well. I would like to play longer, but I gotta get ready for bed. I gotta wake up in like, I don't know, I have to wake up at 4.30, so. Yep, that's where we'll end the stream. A short stream. I'll probably, I'll do some offline uh, playthroughs tomorrow, or, or maybe I'll jump on just to make up for tonight's. But I need to get some rest. Peace out, crab. See you on tomorrow night's uh, stream uh, when you play some uh, some div the diver. Okay, bye bye.